mess is so good and it's spicy. I already got it seasoned from Publix. <laughs> I'm looking at myself. Hey y'all. So, I'm supposed to go to the gym today and did not make it to the gym. But I am hungry and I am about to try this um, cauliflower flatbread. I think it's called, I think it's from the Outer Owls. Um, but yeah, it's gonna be quick, simple. But I'll share it with y'all. Alright. Show y'all some more soon. Hmm. So I got some Cajun filet. Fresh, never frozen catfish from Publix. I had it once it was really, really good so I am about to eat it again the last time I had it grilled and it was on point this time I'm gonna do it inside the oven and then bake it then boil it and then I'm gonna make some sandwiches out of it you want to put them down on the pan in a single layer Hello. All right, so here we go, single layer. I'm gonna go ahead and put it in the oven. And yes, this is all for me. I'm greedy. These are the wraps that I'm going to be using. Well, flatbreads. It is by Outer Layer, Plant Power, Sandwich Thins, Carbs or Toast. And in the back of it, one piece is only 50 calories. And there goes all the other two grams of carbohydrates, one gram of fiber, protein, four grams. Yeah, looks good to me. I can eat about four of these and not feel bad. Like I said, I'm greedy. So shut up. <laughs> All right, y'all. Here goes the catfish. I baked it and I blackened it. Here goes my condiments that I'm going to put on it. I'm going to put Gouda cheese, tomatoes, and spinach. And then I also... Here goes the bread. And I already put my mayonnaise on it. So we're going to start to assemble the sandwiches. All right, as y'all can see, I started to assemble the sandwiches. I got the Cajun catfish on here, and it is boneless. They're fillets. I already put a piece of Gouda cheese on. I'm going to put the next piece. Sorry y'all, one hand is hard. I always hear people say that. And it is, I didn't use my tripod today. I 
then I cut up all these tomatoes. Yep, some spinach I already tried to jump on. Use a little sauce spillage on the side, y'all. Don't don't judge. Don't judge. See if I can back this up a little bit. Don't judge. And yes, these are two separate sandwiches, so just next to each other, making it a little easier for me to put the stuff on. <laughs> Alright, and I am going to put the tops on. This top got messed up because I did freeze them. They last longer frozen. I wasn't ready to eat them when I got them. So the other pieces in the bag, I thought it belonged to another piece until I realized it went to that piece and it's all good. But yeah, here goes the sandwiches. Mm, and I'm going to let y'all know what the calories and all type of stuff is before I eat it. All right. Love y'all. Bye. All right, y'all, I'm close. <laughs> Time for another food. Food review. And I guess mukbang. Yay, y'all ready to eat and learn some more about some good healthy alternatives? I am. <laughs> show y'all the calories the only thing that had the most calories on here is let me see if I can get the focus is the fish I got me in 15 ounces of Cajun filet catfish today so it's like 794 calories and then I am for the bread I am using it's these cauliflower flatbreads from outer owl so I'm gonna be tasting that today for my first time and y'all see the avocados on the side because I've got to put them on so I had to add that into my calories too but for both of these sandwiches together it is 1,690 calories. That's both of them together. Mind y'all, this is my only meal for today. So one sandwich is 845 calories. Most likely because I added the avocado, which we know avocado is high in calories, but great um fats the fats is very healthy for you so it's like you shouldn't feel really bad about it you know so yeah i am going to go ahead and add my avocado on here and we're going to take a couple bites taste it see how it is all right y'all so this catfish sandwich is so good and this outer owl cauliflower flatbread is delicious. It's a little soft, um, which is fine. It's not like it's too mushy or anything like that. I was afraid it was going to be too mushy, but it's actually really, really good. But remember, you can toast it. 
you can toast it to make it a little bit crispier or anything like that but it is so good mm. and I added my avocado you want a close up I just want to eat Can I see it? This is so good. And it's spicy. I already got it seasoned from Publix. Remember, I got the catfish from Publix. It is so good and it is spicy. You don't like spicy food? No mess with it. But it's spicy. Mm. And this Gouda cheese pairs perfectly with everything. I know y'all saw five pieces of fish on the pan, but I was nice and I gave my mom one piece. Okay. I know y'all wonder, do I feel bad for eating all this? I don't. The majority of this is vegetables. Remember the flatbread made out of cauliflower? I got spinach. I got avocado. This is the fruit. I got tomato, some light mayonnaise, um, gouda cheese, and then the fish. And most likely, this will be my only meal for supper. I guess you can say I'm intermediate fasting. I basically intermediate fast ones every day. Uh oh. Got a bone. Supposed to be boneless. I know. I can't get them all. But it's the only one I have. And this is my second time getting it from them. I'm lazy. I can't be doing all that, taking out the bone stuff. Mm. That was so good. And I'm just drinking water. Y'all know how I do. No juice, no sodas. And that's all day long, just not with meals. Because like I said, I like to eat my calories. Excuse me. 
It says drink my calories. Yes, I am about to eat this. I didn't think I was going to be able to. Might not be able to. This avocado is making it so messy. Hold on. It's making it slide everywhere. Avocado is so good, but it makes everything slide. Let me see if I can fix this. Y'all see that? So juicy. Mm. Out of owls, y'all did so good with making this cauliflower flatbread. I have the pizza crust too, and I haven't used it yet. That will be next. I'm making a mess. Yeah, we'll be next. Told y'all, I am all about healthy alternatives. And I am big on quantity. Quality, of course, but quantity. I'm going to be able to eat as much as I can without feeling bad. And without going over my calories ridiculously. And eating stuff that I know I can burn quickly. If this was regular bread... Yes, I'll be able to burn it, but not as fast as burning vegetables. And it still looks so good because, like, getting a messy burger or a messy sandwich from, like, your favorite burger or sandwich place, you know? The messier, the better it tastes. Hmm. I just bit my finger. It's good.
I'm getting full. I can't even talk no more. Last bite, I think. That was so good. Ooh. Like I said, it was one of those sandwiches was excuse me. Was eight hundred and forty five calories. And you're like, dang, that's a lot of calories for that. But most of the calories came from the fish, like I said. Came from the fish because the flatbread was only... Each piece of that flatbread, the cauliflower flat, flatbread, was only 50 calories a piece. So, those two sandwiches that I ate was the whole meal including the avocado that's another thing the avocado is high in calories too was 1690 that's everything all together so i said the catfish was 794 calories imagine if i would have took the catfish off that means this whole meal would have been 896 calories and one sandwich would have been 448 calories. That's including the avocado. But that was so good. Hope y'all enjoyed the video. And soon I will be trying the Outer Isles Pizza Dome. I'm sorry. Pizza Bread. Because it's already actually baked and cooked for me. Which I love. I don't have to mix nothing or put nothing together. Like I said before, the easier, the better. All right, y'all. I will see y'all on next video. Hopefully, next video will probably be a workout video. I was going to do a workout video today, but I didn't make it to the gym. So, hopefully, the next one is a workout video. If not, it will be another review. And I guess mukbang <laughs> for y'all. Alright, I love y'all. See y'all soon. Bye.